increasing the 1 lakh rupee investment limit, which is better known as the ATC limit. Uh, that will be uh, changed to 2 lakh rupees, what we understand. The scaling up would really help arrest the slide in household savings into financial assets. Uh, I think we do have Tanvi on this story. Tanvi, take it over. What details do we have in terms of what's being worked out at this point? Well, indeed, Vivek, one of the suggestions, uh, one of the proposals, rather, that the finance ministry and the government seem to be working on is increasing the amount that you can save under ATC section. So currently, uh, any taxpayer is allowed to invest up to 1 lakh rupees and gets a tax exemption on it. The proposal is to incre increase this to 2 lakh rupees. Now, remember, currently, again, this includes uh, even your housing loans and any other kind of savings, but the proposal uh, is supposed to be only for financial savings. The idea, of course, is one, to ensure that um, there is some relief coming in for taxpayers. But on the other hand, this will ensure that there, there are more financial savings that take place. Savings on an overall basis for the country go up. And some of this money really goes out there into the markets, uh, uh, into the equity market. So uh, that's the real thought process here. Of course, the government and the finance ministry currently is working on the potential revenue loss that this could cause to for various financial institutions. In fact, some of the bankers even raised this issue in their meeting with the finance minister just uh, yesterday uh, and, and suggesting some ways, including doing away with tax-free bonds as a way to compensate for this revenue loss. So they are working on the estimates there. On the other hand, they need to compare that uh, to the potential upside of such a move where you could see a lot more money coming in to the equity market or any kind of financial products. So again, the idea is to move away uh, from other ways of uh, savings and really get some money out there into the markets.